petroleum age to an age based on renewable resources. The benefits for Europe are tremendous from creating new jobs in rural areas, new market opportunities for farmers and landowners and forest owners, innovation opportunities uh, for scientists to engage, and great environmental benefits. The excitement I think on the consumer side is really being able to get the products with the functionalities they want but also with a lower carbon footprint, a better sustainability profile. The EU is making a big push on the bioeconomy which is really welcome from an industry point of view but we really have to now get the market pulled. We have the technologies but now we really need to see how that fits with what the consumer wants. What is really important now to see that vision realized is for consistent policy to be put in place so that companies can invest with a lot of confidence and with a long-term view for investment. The EU and policymakers have a key role to create market signals, uh, very clear, predictable market standards that encourages industry to invest and to create uh, biorefineries that can make those products based on renewable resources. One of the challenges remains the scarcity of funding for late stage scale up and commercialization which is obviously critical. The European Investment Bank could play a much more active role. Uh, it is making uh, so-called risk financing uh, loans available but it's only to large cor corporations. Extending that to SMEs would be an, a major help to develop this industry in Europe. Europe has all the ingredients to be a leader in the industrial biotechnology and in the bio-based economy. Having said that, uh, today the reality is that we as an industry mainly deploy uh, these advantages elsewhere in the United States, in Brazil, in China. We have companies uh, today in Europe that developed uh, breakthrough uh, processes that uh, actually are coming on the market with new molecules replacement for PET bottles, for instance, by using PEF for Ferenix. It is very difficult for these companies to find the necessary next round financing in Europe. As a result, they're more likely to move to the US. We need to get uh, the value chains connected. We need to get the market incentives in place, the quality standards established in order for Europe to catch up and claim the leadership role it rightly should have in the bio-based economy.